Hey guys, what's going on? To a cruise here at the Giant Store in Eastern Nagoya, Japan. We're here today because they've got some new releases out. The new Giant Propel 2019 model uh, just arrived in the store today, so we came over to give it a quick look. This store is actually pretty close to where we live over here in the east side of Nagoya, so we're pretty big fans of Giant and pretty big fans of the Propel model, so let's go check out some of the features of the new 2019 models. So they've got two of the main ones here right now. They've got the Propel Advanced SL1 disc, this one is retailing here in Japan for about 770,000 yen, so about seven grand. And it's really hard for this paint color to come in on the camera, but it's got a beautiful sort of shine to it that you can only really see in the light. And it's really not picking up that well here in the camera, but a beautiful dark color here, but also kind of little like uh, rainbow sparkles. Here they go, they're starting to come in on the camera right now. A beautiful finish on this right here. A bit of some of the anodized lettering here right now. Absolute beautiful finish here. The front end of the Propel here is really super efficient. They've got this really interesting custom front handlebar setup. The blade style handlebars. This one's outfitted with Shimano Ultegra shifters. Super aero profile here up in the front of the bike. No space wasted. This is the new disc models. Everything's switching to disc now. We've got the one SLR1 tubeless ready aero wheels here. This particular model is the S size. We can see they've also got the Ultegra crank here. The electronic shifters, rear derailleur. And here's the back profile as well, the back rear triangle. Again, pretty aggressive, pretty aero approach here. Looking at the bike from the very back, Really aero profile. No wasted extra drag here. Here's the mount area for the disc brakes. Some cable routing, which then goes into the frame. Pretty chunky piece of frame material right here. Then the inside of this tubing is actually pretty square, so that's pretty interesting. And here's the shape for the triangle on the back side. And last here's the seat post design and seat attachment. Overall, really beautiful setup, but let's continue and move along to the big bad boy here. This is the reason we came here today. This is the Propel Advanced SL Zero Disc 2019. This one's retailing for quite a bit more, so 1,200,000 yen. A uh, bit over 10 grand, 11 grand or so with the current exchange rate and one of the main reasons for that difference in price is the upgrade here to top of the line Dura-Ace. I believe this also has a built-in power meter as well to the crank here. And again, beautiful frame color here as well. I do love the frame paint job of the SL1, the black, but I'm a big fan of blue bikes. Beautiful color here as well. front bar setup seems to be pretty much the same and moving back to the back side we're continuing on we've got the rest of our Dura Ace parts here rear derailleur pretty interesting here the cable running here going through the bottom triangle back here just coming out right here at the end pretty minimalistic cable here These appear to be different wheels on here. SLR2 uh, arrow, if I'm reading that correctly. And this is the SLR1 on this model. Let's get one last look at the full bike here. Really standing out here on top display in the giant store right now. You may have noticed my wife here in the background. <laughs> She's also a big fan of Giant. She's been mesmerized by this bike. This is one of her favorites here. The Giant Sunweb Team Edition. We recently, she just saw this one for the first time in Taiwan, became a big fan. Though, Giant no atarashi jitensha no incho wa? Nanka. Dochi ga ski? Kuro no ho? Ao no ho? Ao no ho wa ski na? Ao no ho? Mm. 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 Mm.
じゃあ、あ、好きだね。<笑>なんか。風みたいに。これ、ついに、はだしピローで。走れる。<笑>そういうの、いいぞ。ああ。最初見ると。うん。I'm actually not sure how to say arrow in Japanese, but really arrow frame, so she said that it just looks like cuts through the wind. <laughs> so, even though she likes the Propel, she's still a big fan of the giant TCR. This is her dream bike. She's hoping to buy it one day. It's a good one. It's a good one. Oh, yeah, let's check out some of the other specs on here. So, we haven't looked at those. This one is weighted to be about 7.1 kilograms. Let's see what the propels are 7.5 for the SL1. That's not bad. Oh, wow. And for the SL0 disc, this is only 7.2. So, this aero bike is almost the same weight as this、uh, climbing bike. That's pretty impressive. Anyway, that's going to be it for this video. We're just going to be introducing the new propel models here. Uh, we're gonna also show around the rest of the shop, so if you're interested in seeing what else they got here, you can go check out that video. We'll link it here at the end of the video. And if you like these kinds of videos, want to see more bike shop tours here in Japan, let us know down in the comments. We'll see you next time here on Tuo Cruise. Hopefully, we'll see you right in the next video coming up. See ya!